Uh, Truly Madly Guilty is a story of something that happens at a barbecue. So it's a, a neighbourhood barbecue in an ordinary backyard on an ordinary Sunday. Um, there are six people, six adults at the barbecue, three children and one little puppy dog. And something happens, and I can't tell you anything more, but uh, something that happens that profoundly affects everyone who's there at the barbecue. Well, I admit to stealing little parts of, um, of people I know, but I've never stolen a whole person. So just little attributes are often the starting point to, to somebody. Oh, it's funny actually, I find that friends, uh, they never recognise themselves if I have taken a little part of themselves, but they often uh, think that it's them, and in fact in my mind it's got nothing to, uh. nothing to do with them, so it's interesting. Truly Madly Guilty was inspired by something that happened to me at a barbecue. I can't tell you what happened because that would give away well, too much. I think all authors in their first their first novels are probably the most autobiographical. So I think the character of Cat in my novel Three Wishes is probably the one that is closest to me. Maybe although she wasn't she wasn't that nice. <laughs> um, so I'm not sure. But no, across and definitely and truly madly guilty, there's nobody who I'd say is close to me at all. If people come up to me at a party and say, what sort of books do you write? I, I don't know. I haven't yet worked out a quick, easy uh, answer. I normally say, what sort of books do you like? And then I can tell if they'd like mine. <laughs>